Welcome back, everyone. Happy Groundhog Day. If you haven't heard, Punxsutawney Phil and if you're a fan of Ohio and Buckeye Chuck, they each did not see their shadow, meaning we're looking at an early spring for 2024. Now, when you think about Groundhog Day falling on a Friday, it's only happened nine times since 1950. This is just the third time that Phil has not seen his shadow when Groundhog Day falls on a Friday in February. So a rare, rare occurrence. It's been 17 years. We'll see if it actually pans out uh, or not. You may or may not see your shadow today with lots of clouds filtering out the sun, but by tomorrow, everybody will see their shadow because we are looking at abundant sunshine across the entire Ohio Valley. And, and there's a very outside chance, probably less than 10%, one or two of us see a stray sprinkle on Sunday, but for the most part, we should be dry. As you look, Weather Prediction Center here saying over the next seven days, very little in the way of precipitation. And a lot of this, what we're seeing for our area in the Ohio Valley is for later next week as a weather maker makes its way toward the area because this goes out seven days further to the southwest. A lot of that is for late in the week and they have a much better chance of rain. I'll show you that here in a second. Rest of the morning, really nothing to worry about uh, as you head to work. Uh, maybe later this morning, upper 30s for the most part. And then by this afternoon, many of you headed home, mid 40s with a nice mix of clouds and sunshine. And over the next 24 hours, really not too bad either uh, with temperatures of 40s and 30s for the most part. As we turn our attention to later in the weekend, by Saturday night, here's our weather maker over northeast Arkansas, the Jonesboro area, going to kind of dance around for a day or so, and that could pull some precipitation towards southwest parts of the state. For us, we're just most likely going to see the clouds. Now, the models are going a little bit back and forth on this. We'll see how much rainfall actually makes it this far north. I doubt, though, we'll see any precipitation this weekend. So mid-40s today under mostly cloudy to considerable cloudiness conditions. That's about where most of us will be in and around the Ohio Valley. And then tonight, we'll see temperatures upper 20s uh, for the most part. A pretty seasonal night, really nothing to worry about as we head into the weekend. Sky should slowly clear out. As we look at the extended forecast, yeah, lots of sunshine over the next couple of days. Saturday looks great. Back to work and school on Monday also looking great. And then as we get toward the second half of next week, temperatures really warming up as we're gonna start to flirt with 60 degrees.